I'm Dean Napolitano of the Wall Street Journal, here today with Eddie Pang, the star of Unbeatable. Welcome. In the film, you play a lost soul who takes up mixed martial arts in the hope of regaining the respect of his father. Did you have a background in boxing or mixed martial arts? Actually, I did have a boxing background, but it was in a role I did before. Like, so luckily, this time I'm doing MMA, I don't need to learn boxing. What was the training like for Unbeatable? Was it more intense this time around? This time, yeah, definitely. It's like two, two months solid training. So like, how many hours a day of training was that? At least like six to eight. During shooting, 10 hours, and then you go back to the hotel, and then oh, I have to do another hour <laughs> for the weight training because you don't want your muscle to, go, to, to, to you know, just boom, gone, right? Did you have to change your diet? What sort of things did you eat? What kind of foods did you avoid? Actually, the diet is the most important part during the training. You have to eat well, sleep well, basically live like a pig. You eat and sleep, and that's all you do every day. Of course, one thing, we're not the real MMA fighter, so we have to look, look pretty. So that's why we go on diet. Actually, I asked my uh, MMA trainer, so do you guys go on diet? I said, no, no, no way. We never go on diet. We eat crazy. Now, what about when, the, when you stopped shooting, when you were finished shooting the film? Did you keep up with that diet or did you go back to the Are you carbs? kidding me? No way. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, every day, me and Nick talking every day. It was like shooting. During the shooting, it was like, we got to you know, book a VIP restaurant and then you know, just all, all beef, all, all kind of sweets. And then right after we finish the last scene, we just go right up to the restaurant and go eat like crazy, like a dog, and then eat all the food on the table. Did you get any injuries? Were you hurt at all? Before, I didn't know I, I was going to fight real fighters. These two real fighters, I, uh, one called Mike. I remember one time he, uh, he actually punched me in the face, and then I couldn't hear a thing. And then he was like, oh. but the camera is still shooting, right? So I was like, no, let's keep doing it, let's keep doing it. That's why my ear got bigger now. Yeah, you can tell. I'm bigger. <laughs> do you think that you would ever get into a ring for real and do an MMA? No, 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 that's not. <laughs> I cannot imagine me real of getting into the fight. If there's another role, need me to change physically or mentally, I'll definitely do that. So I, right now, it's just you know, easy, no more uh, actor. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you.